Am I the arsehole? For not congratulating my sill on her pregnancy? My 30 watts sill 33 watts just announced her first pregnancy. Me and my husband her brother already have a two year old and her twin sister already got a few kids, so she was the last of us childless. Here comes the twist, we lost our second born in July on their birth, in an absolute unpredictable way. We personally don't wait until a certain week to announce a pregnancy because life is unpredictable and you have no guarantees anyway. So we announced this pregnancy way before week 12 and her exact words were you're pretty brave to announce the pregnancy that early. The birth of said child was also the reason we weren't able to attend her wedding which just happened on the same day a four hour drive away we didn't spread the news about our son's death on that day though. She announced her pregnancy at a little get together that originally took place to celebrate her and her twin sister's birthday. Apparently she wasn't pregnant with one children but twins but lost the child early into pregnancy. And she was openly happy about it. She started listing all the reasons she was glad that she didn't have to buy everything twice and didn't have to do twice the work act. I was sitting across the table and I didn't even know how to react, first of all of course her pregnancy announcement triggered some feelings of jealousy and I would have wished for her to tell us beforehand and not in a room full of people. But I'm not mad about that or anything although I find it a bit insensitive. On the other hand her happiness about losing a child left me speechless, I mean I guess I kinda get her train of thoughts but I think some thoughts are inside thoughts and I must admit I felt offended about being confronted with her reaction to child loss in that kinda way. Anyway neither me not my husband got up to hug her or congratulate her and she later on texted my husband that she wasn't happy about the way we acted. Nah it's all a very difficult. I'm so sorry for your loss and of course you're still grieving and comments hurt and that's okay. You're allowed to feel that way and also a little jealous. Your sill is also allowed to feel the way she does and honestly sounds like she may be putting on a brave face and making joking comments as many of us do as a way of dealing with her own grief. Maybe instead of growing apart, and being bitter reach out and be each other's support for you both have lost and are grieving. Edit typo. Your sill is probably trying to rationalize her grief. I don't see any R's here. I don't think anyone here is an asshole. I'm so sorry for your loss. Nah but you are kind of in the wrong. She lost a baby too. And she's dealing with as best she can. She doesn't owe you anything and she doesn't have to tell you separately. It's her news to share as she sees fit. You didn't have to hug her but a simple yay or I'm happy for you would have been sufficient. Nah. I get why her comments would have been jarring to you, but you have to remember that everyone deals with loss differently. I'm so sorry for your loss, pensive face. Not the asshole I was very pregnant when someone lost a baby and I knew to stay away from her because she was grieving. I asked her husband if I could send anything over to their house but my baby belly was not something she needed to see when she was hurting. So sorry for your loss. Not the asshole. She wouldn't have been an either if she hadn't called you and your husband to admonish the two of you for not reacting with joy. She is allowed to feel her feelings, but her trying to force you into faking happiness for her is a nah move. I just want to say I'm sorry for your loss. I lost my second son two years ago on the 15th of November. My friend had a baby on his due date and I couldn't even look at that baby. I would hide if they were in the same place as me. We all react differently when losing a child. It's the worst thing in the world. This month is pregnancy and infant loss awareness month and we'll be thinking of your baby too. Let her be unhappy. She was processing her feelings her way. You were processing your feelings your way. Given the background, you and your husband can be given a pass for not responding with immediate joy. That moment is past now you can move forward with more positive feelings toward the birth of this newest child to the family. Now here. You had a valid, emotional response since you were still recovering from your loss. She is likely putting on a brave face and trying to be happy for the surviving twin. I would still write it all out and apologize, 
just saying that the lost twin triggered your grief so you weren't at your best. Congratulate her for her future offspring coming, and try to move on. It's nice to see everyone thinks it's her way of coping, but what if she really doesn't care and is actually very happy about it? This may not be a coping thing. I'm sorry honey for your loss. Big hugs. Nah. She's rationalizing her grief at losing an unborn child. It has nothing to do with you or your own loss. She can be unhappy about your lack of congratulations, but your DH can and should explain that the two of you are still grieving, and were a little taken about by the way she was finding the positives in losing a child. You were shocked and overwhelmed but meant her no personal disrespect. Not the asshole. Maybe she truly isn't happy about losing one of the babies but this is just her way of coping right now. Not the asshole, but congratulate her. Every child is worth celebrating. When I lost my child in the second trimester, between my tears, I mumbled, I didn't want a newborn in February either way it helped me cope with losing my child. She is doing the same. Dealing with family is hard. Dealing with family that is dealing with trauma is even harder. You all are processing grief and expressing it in different ways. For you it might be jealousy and depression. For her, it might be putting on a happy face and trying to ignore it. You don't know what she's feeling behind closed doors. You all need to give each other some grace. I would just explain you and your husband are still dealing with grief and need some space and to not take it personally. Then wish her the best and say you're happy for her. Not the asshole. Consideration of others goes both ways. Sounds like the happy about not buying two of everything is a cope, flushed face, she's probably really heartbroken, trying to convince herself that it's better this was. Either way, totally inappropriate and I'd be offended too. Baby loss is not a joking matter, it's with you forever, and it's heartbreaking. Maybe talk to her. Tell her how you felt and see how she is really feeling and that obviously you are happy for them but still felt horrible. Not the asshole. Wow. How tone deaf can you get? Still needed to read the room. Not the asshole. Honestly she wouldn't have even been an asshole until she called to tell you she was made about you guys not congratulating her. She knows that you lost a baby three months ago. It would have been a kindness to share the news in private ahead of time. And regardless of her feelings it's fairly insensitive to make comments about being happy she lost one of the fetuses while in the room with someone who lost their baby so recently. To then call about your lack of congratulations puts her fairly into asshole territory. Having lost a child to full term stillbirth and one to miscarriage you are not the ass. She is 100 the ass. And she can kick bricks. Anyone who calls you YTA is absolutely wrong. I am honestly confused on what my vote should be, because on the one hand, you both lost kids, so I feel like this could be your sills way of coping. On the other hand, if she felt like you weren't happy, she could have simply tried to sympathize with you, because she was being happy about losing a baby and it wouldn't be fair on you. Nah, because the situation is horrible for both of you. Nah both yours and hers feelings are valid.